I'm going to talk to you today about what's going on with this Steve, whatever, I don't want to say exactly with YouTube and whatever they got going on. Where I live, I live in Luzerne County, Pennsylvania. There's a nursing home, Timber Ridge, in Wolfsburg, Pennsylvania. How is it two nurses that did a one-on-one, -on -one, one was out of the country, the other on an international conference down in Florida. Both of them came to work. Both them nurses, licensed professionals, should have known better. What did they do? Did a one-on-one -on -one with this patient. That patient died three days later. A week later, six people dead. Three weeks later, 24 people dead. Now this is where it really gets interesting. I'm not a professional, I'm not a licensed professional, never claimed to be. But it is common sense. When you're in a facility and you have rooms like this to keep the virus in so it don't affect other people, you do not have a nurse working on a floating shift going from floor to floor where people ain't sick. That's how you spread a virus. You don't reuse masks. You don't reuse gowns and go between sick people and not sick people. And people wonder why there's a big outbreak. 31 deaths in my city. 24 of them are from Timber Ridge Nursing Home. Why isn't it investigated? I'd love to know. I've been trying to get a hold of everybody. I even gave an outcry on the CDC website. The CDC, uh, whatchamacallit, on uh, YouTube. Nobody cares. The everyone's putting the blame on a bunch of people that live in the city. Private citizens. Oh, let's do our part. When these nursing homes are the ones killing people. It's sad. Over a million dollars a month they're getting for all these people staying there. And they can't afford masks and respirators so they're not spreading the virus. They're killing people. Not the people that are sitting home trying to protect people. They're spreading it. Not us. Some investigation better happen. Because I tell you this. Timber Ridge. I got COVID-19 because of you, because you didn't do your job. That's what happens when you reuse your mask and reuse your gowns and put them in a paper bag and have the workers use them the following day to work with more people. You spread it. You caused it. I almost died because of your actions. My son almost died because of your actions. I had to go to sleep for a week straight wondering if I was going to wake up to be able to kiss my son the following day. Stop killing people. Do your job. You're a professional. You're a licensed professional. The damage is done. You already killed most of the people in my city because of your actions. Was it worth them couple dollars of all the people you killed because you didn't do your job properly? A licensed medical professional should have known better. Somebody has got to do something about this. Because more and more people are dying at the hands of our health care system. Not the people that are staying home. The people in the nursing homes. The ones who think it's okay to not use their moral judgment as a person. If you can't understand or comprehend 
how not to spread an illness, as a licensed professional, you shouldn't have your job. You should lose your license, and you should go on trial for murder. You should know better. It's not like you're just some some little kid working at uh, McDonald's and you screwed up a food order. These are people's lives. People's lives. That should have known better. Yeah, you could have. Have the workers wear two masks now. It's too late. It's already done. It's already spread. You spread it to the families of the workers. By allowing them to work in them conditions. And the kicker. The, the high up. You know what her words were? They're under contract. So if them nurses didn't put their lives on a line and go to work. They'd lose their license, their job, their livelihood. Because of other people's stupidity. There's nurses that knew, and there's other nurses that should have known better. And these higher-ups didn't care? Oh, you're under contract? Is that what people's lives are to you that you're trying to save? Just a contract? Your nurses are under contract. The people you're saving, you're, you're, you're treating... They're human beings. You should use moral judgment next time. Any father should never have to go to bed wondering if they're going to be alive the next day and kiss their son. I went through a week of hell wondering if I was going to die. After it came back, I had COVID-19 from your stupidity, from your, whoever was in charge that allowed them two nurses to come in and work that caused the outbreak at that nursing home. Now remember, 31 deaths in the whole city, 24 of them at one nursing home. Use your common sense, people. Wake the fuck up.